candy. <laughs> <laughs> the proud recipient. You look like you could use a beer. Yeah, sometimes I just kind of have a disgruntled, haggard face that, we'll get into it. <laughs> sometimes the symbols gestures are the best, whether it is by mail or in person, please pass along a beer with this note to brighten someone's day. We would love to see how far this goes, so feel free to contact slash tag us on social media. Cheers. From Billy Noss to Sean Ely, Midwest Brew Review launching the, a pay it forward, a beer forward, a beer pass along. Noise circulation is in the spirit of the holidays, you know, I want you to pass on a beer to another person. That's all, and maybe we can get this thing going for a little bit and then you know, brighten someone's day. Basically, I'm gonna also think of a beer and a person and then ship it to them and then write it on here and then they're gonna get this and you know, da 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 We're taking over the world. We take All thanks to Midwest Brew Reviews, Billy Noss, AKA Justice Sip. All right, everybody, welcome back to Justice Sip. We are plowing our way through the Advent Aldi beer calendar. See, they call that segment Justice Sip, but my closed captioning was on on YouTube, and it sounded like you said Justice Sip, and then YouTube was like, no, he said Justice Sip. So now, forever, Billy is Justice Sip. Welcome back to Just a Sip. So Billy being very nice, sending me two. He sent me more brewing company. They're incredible in the suburbs. They win a ton of awards. They're Tank Sweat, Dry Hopped Lager, Citra, Mosaic, and Lotus Hops. 5% alcohol by volume. One of the coolest cans I've seen. That brewery getting swole. Holly, Illinois, and Villa Park, Illinois. And then also more brewing companies, Hush of Night a milk stout with dark matter coffee. This dude gets me. Wow, he did really well in the game that he thought of. He's winning. 7% alcohol by volume. I love dark matter coffee. It's a local coffee roastery here in Chicago. Mwah. They one time did a cold brew with Malort in it. I'm trying to get my hands on some. Give it to me now. I'm gonna go with the Hush of Night, that milk stout with dark matter coffee. It's like 30 degrees maybe, and I'm freezing. So let's drink stouts. Take a sip, just a sip. Oh my God, that smells incredible. Just like a good toasted smell. It's got cocoa and coffee and mm. But you did read the title of this video correctly. I am gonna be giving away some beer. So on that sheet, rather than just sending a beer to somebody I already know really well, I wanna hear from you guys of what your favorite beer is, drop it in the comments below and make sure you subscribe to Midwest Brew Review. Those are the two things I'm checking. Subscribe to them, comment on this video with your favorite beer of all time and you're in the running to be the person that I pass this forward to. I'm gonna send you two of my favorite winter beers from here in Chicago, Illinois. So do that now. Billy, Brian, Matt, they have an awesome channel. Let's grow that following. Give them love because they put so much of their own love into that channel. They're my favorite beer channel on the internet. I consider those guys brothers and not just because two of them are redheads and look a lot like me. <laughs> All right, so do that now. Cheers, let's try this out. My first time ever drinking a Moore Hush of Night. Oh no, I'm sorry, it's the Moops. It's Moore's, it's a misprint. I'm sorry, the card says Moops. Cheers. Oh, Billy knows how to pick beer. Being one of the first people that he started this for, I'm playing with a corked bat, dude. I got a corked bat. I got three vials of steroids injected right into my upper butt. I play in Oakland in the 80s. I'm up to bat. Let's bash, let's bash, let's bash, let's bash, let's bash, let's bash, Holy smokes, it's so good. If you like dark beer. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you know who likes milk stouts even more than I do? is number two in the power rankings, Ali Mo. Me. Me. Here. Me. You're gonna love this. You're gonna like the way you drink, I guarantee it. it smells really good. It sure does. Wow. I went to Fobab this year, the festival of barrel aged brewing, with Ali and Midwest Brew Review. So we spent a lot of time drinking dark beers together, and it was really fun watching them nerd out together because they've all never really hung out. Like I hang out with Midwest Brew Review all the time at beer festivals, and I go to different beer festivals with Ali. So the fact that we could all be together and kind of just chilling for like five hours and getting pretty toasty was legendary. You like it? 
Yes, it's incredible. My thought is kind of moot. If Allie likes it, that's how you know it's good. Okay, so for the giveaway, obviously, you have to be 21 years of age, you have to live in America, and you have to live in a state where you can legally accept beer. <laughs> so I'm gonna be checking. I'm gonna be checking my list once, twice, am I Santa? Um, but anyways, follow those rules, and I'm so excited to connect with one of you guys. I'll look at all the comments, I'll pick a winner randomly, and uh, you'll get some beer. And hopefully you can film an unboxing. If not, that's okay too. You'll at least get this awesome letter, and then you'll also have to pass some beer along, so. Oh my God, it's so good. Now before I let you guys get out of here today, this is Allie's pumpkin soup. Well, it's a friend of ours who passed it on to us, but I consider it Allie's pumpkin soup recipe. She's really mastered this. Uh, it's delicious, she made it today. A Little bit of that sour cream, some chives, some crushed red pepper. This with a beer tonight. I'm going a little lighter on dinner tonight because we got an epic weekend of eating with some friends. So I'm gonna keep it light, keep it tight. This is one of those things like, you never think you want pumpkin soup until you have it and you're like, oh. I actually love pumpkin as a food. Oh my God. Think of like the consistency of like a really thicker like tomato or lobster bisque. Kind of like that bisky. That'd be a good last name. Sean Bisky. That's the consistency and then it's so salty and warm and holiday-y. <laughs> Adjectives. This guy loves taking nouns and turning them into adjectives. What an insane, like, I didn't know what Billy sent me. And then 10 minutes later, this is all happening. It actually didn't make any sense that I used that clip. I'm excited to read your guys' favorite beers, and I'm excited to send someone my two favorites. Like somebody that I don't know personally. This community has been so gracious to me in 2022 and I'm so thankful for being able to do kind of my own vlog and like just do a bunch of random stuff, make the most random meals this year. I've had some of the most fun food in the past 12 months of my life thanks to you guys and I just, I truly cherish this fun little place to just be a dumb dumb on the internet. Do you think you were gonna watch a guy eat soup today? <laughs> no. It's like Ben Dean, my favorite food YouTuber, like I'll watch him eat anything. Like he could literally just sit there and eat Tic Tacs and I would, it's, it's so intriguing. Now I'll never have the following he does, but if I have a thousand people that dig this, my psychiatrist in high school said I would never even know a thousand people. She was fired though, for unrelated reasons. Any, anyway, um, adding crushed red pepper to soups, is there anything better? Like yes, there absolutely is, but shut up. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. Go watch Just a Sip, Billy's daily vlog on Midwest Brew Review up until, what, like the 24th or something like that? And then Matt's gonna take over and do a bunch of fun stuff daily on the channel. So, so many great things coming on that channel. Please go subscribe. Personal favor to me. I love those boys. I want more people to watch their videos because they're just so charming and fun and handsome and intelligent, beer knowledgeable. Adjectives. All right, Hush of Night with some pumpkin soup up. Hush of night with some pumpkin soup down. Happy freaking holidays. Mm. Go Lions. Hey there, my buddy.